Hey guys, hi, it's Amax Dude here, and I haven't done a video in a long time. And the reason I haven't done a video in a long time is because I've been hanging out with my family more, trying to get to know my new kitty. She's doing great, if any of you guys are wondering. But I saved my best video yet for right now. Who is Clarence's dad? Clarence is a TV show that I like a lot. It actually just got canceled. Got really sad when it was, but it's hilarious. But I don't think that Damien from the new se season is Clarence's dad. What's up, guys? Uh, I'm going to be describing Clarence for you guys at the beginning of this video and talking about my theory toward the end. Clarence is about this dude over here. Clarence is pretty happy all the time and tries to do anything to have fun. It can get pretty gross at times. His best friend Sumo over here does pretty much the same thing. And then there's Jeff, the nerd, who's square all the time. He's Clarence's other best friend. Except he does not like to get involved with Clarence. But with Clarence, you got to have fun. And they get bullied by this dude a lot of the time, Belson. And the weird thing is Clarence doesn't think he's being bullied by Belson. He just thinks, well, Belson's trying to be his friend. It's a little weird at times. And then these are Clarence's so-called parents, his mom's boyfriend, and his mom, or who Cartoon Network tried to make us think was his mom. I don't think so. Uh, and this dude over here is Jeremy. Uh, there was a theory a while back going around the internet that Jeremy was Clarence's long lost twin brother that died when he was really young and that the episode in dreams where Jeremy appears for the first time was just Clarence, uh, only memories of his little or big brother. The only thing they had to go off of that, though, was that we never seen Jeremy before, that he looked like Clarence, and that Clarence had a bunk bed. And I think that Clarence's bunk bed was just sleepovers. I mean, in Stormy Sleepover, which we'll get back to later, he, he's just all about sleepovers for some reason. Um, it's not shown in any of the other uh, parts of the series, but that mini series, Clarence is just all about sleepovers. I'm not debunking the theory, the theory, theory, theory that I'm lost brother. I'm just saying that I'll think it, but it's not because of the bunk bed. And this dude over here is Balance, who I guess from the end of Stormy Sleepover, we can kind of decide as Jeremy's dad. Wait, back up a second, Amax. You said that you think Jeremy's Clarence Long Lost Twin Brother, and you think that Jeremy is Balance's son? Boom! Right there, everyone. Balance is Clarence is dad. And uh, we actually have a lot to go off of this. Clarence looks a lot like Balance. Balance seems to recognize Clarence. He seems to hate Clarence because I have this whole backstory that I'll explain in a bit. Uh, he always seems upset, maybe because he lost both his kids and doesn't seem to have his wife anymore. But you've earned it. It's time to go into the backstory. So Clarence and Jeremy are both the son of Balance. And I, I don't have an idea for who Clarence and ba uh, Jeremy's real mom is. But uh, they give birth to the twins. And... They are noisy kids because they're always trying to do stuff. Go watch In Dreams and you'll see what I'm saying. Uh, and Balance just can't take it anymore. So he puts Clarence up for adoption. And Mary and Damien adopt Clarence. And Damien later splits up with Mary. They weren't actually married yet. And Jeremy just ends up dying because just look at Balance. There's no way this dude's making money. He's dirt poor. And Jeremy, and he can't afford, like, child care, so Jeremy ends up dying. And that's why Balance is always unhappy. His wife also ends up dying. That's why he seems to recognize Clarence and seems so spooked out when he sees him. Because look at this. Doesn't Clarence resemble, doesn't this guy resemble the guy we were just looking at, this guy? So we really have a lot to go off that. The bunk bed, though, the bunk beds, like I said, just for sleepovers. And 
here's a question that I've been thinking about lately. Would Clarence be as always happy as he is if he'd grown up with balance instead of Mary? And the answer is no, definitely not. Balance is an unhappy person who also seems to get some of his character traits from Belson, who is one of the only other unhappy people in the show, Mishu, but Balance and Belson are really the only unhappy ones in the house. And that's really all I have to go off. My next video, I think, will be about the Super Bowl. And everyone, please subscribe, like, and comment on what you thought of my theory. Thank you, guys, and I will see you next time.